let me tour you to Kirkwall, Scotland. Before anything else, a big shout out to Louis Brothers Channel, Michael de Monteverde, Joy Zuwaza, Cynthia Dewi, Before Batao, Huayu, Baniki General, SK Edis, Zanib Zarina, J. Marian Yan, Brother Anz, Pinay Hustler, Neil Mga Oag, Joji David Peter, Maria Cristina Bautista, Old 17, World Views, Salim Malik, and of course, Paul Anthony Garcia. And Nito Labanco. This is my last shore leave because I'll be going home the day after tomorrow. Welcome to Kirkwall, Scotland. Kirkwall is the largest town in Orkney, an archipelago to the north of mainland Scotland. Yeah, uh, Drell, no? St. Magnus Cathedral, Church of Scotland. See, this is the Church of Scotland. There we come. Plenty Philippines. Plenty Philippines on board, man. One day lang. Ano ko pinapastay na trip? Go inside. Look how beautiful that cathedral is. I think we cannot go inside. So this is still the St. Magnus Cathedral. This is a beautiful sacred space filled with tombstones and memorials. The Bishop's and Earl's Palace. Let's roam around the fine courtyard castle, the Earl's Palace. Robert Stewart, half-brother of Mary, Queen of Scots, became the Earl of Orkney in the late 1500s. Let's go check out the ruins of his residence. So we just went out. This is my last day of going out because tomorrow will be our last day of work. And now I have the chance to go out. Because tomorrow we cannot go out anymore. This inside. Maybe people died here. Look, oh, main entrance. Maybe we can go inside. Really? Very nice, no? Very quiet. If they charge us, then let's see what happens. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go inside the palace. Baby, forgive me. Just give this day to me. John! Hi. You see, they're here. This is the Lord's Larders. There are five rooms along this corridor, but in this room, Earl Patrick kept enough provisions to entertain lavishly and feed his large household of servants, heralds, and men-at-arms. He also provided storage for the produce he collected as rents and taxes from tenants, landowners, and fishermen. Such produce were butter, fish, and many others. Oh, very nice out here. This is the one. Or is that the water? Oh my god, yeah, it's water, baby. This is the well at the center of the palace, the water of life. What? 
Maybe the Earl's Palace. So where are we now? First floor. Oh, there's a door. Baby, this is your room, okay? <laughs> wow. Wow, what is here? Hi. In the thick of it, baby. This is the steward's room that sits at the center of the palace. This is where he deals with his problematic business. It was a complex model of web loans and counter loans with no realistic plan for repayment. His appetite for spending drew him deeper and deeper to debt, ultimately well over 150,000 euro. That's completely unmanageable sum back in the 1600s. Waiting in the wings. Oh. Honored visitors could be greeted here before entering the palace's main public room. This is the one? This is the one? Or this one? Ah, yeah, this is the one. <laughs> Waiting in the wings. This is the one. Because it has here. Oh la la, host with the most. Oh, this is where they gather. This is where they gather. This is the Great Hall, the main public room of the palace. Before his arrest for treason, Patrick have used the hall for lavish gatherings. Ah, this is the behind. This is the one behind, baby. Baby, look at the grass. It's like it's not real, no? When you look there. Just a real view. Yeah, but it doesn't look real from afar. You know, if you didn't come, I would still go here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because I want to vlog this one. Which one? This one. This one? Yeah. But the problem is I'm already low, but I'm just using my phone right now. It's not good. Oh, this is the other side. An audience with the Earl. And so this is the room. This room was probably designed as a private outer chamber where Earl Patrick could hold business meetings or entertain privileged guests. Mm, this is... Ah, baby! This is the one, the one we see outside there, oh, when we were there, down. And we were taking picture there to get this picture here. See, it's here. Hello. Hey. We take pictures of us, we take we'll pictures take of you. Of you. Oh, okay. Romeo, Romeo. Romeo, Romeo. Romeo. <laughs> Romeo. 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 Whoa, inner sanctum. Oh, oh wow. This bedchamber was Earl Patrick's most private room. He would have spared no expense to make it comfortable and attractive. Aside from sleeping in this room, Earl Patrick would have used this room to entertain intimate friends and associates. Yeah, this one. What is that for? You see, they have one of there. That one. Oh, what is that? Oh, maybe fireplace. Ah, uh, oh, maybe I don't know. Elevator. Elevator. <laughs> In today's world, baby, it's elevator. Yeah, it's a fireplace. This one. Is this one local? So her bed was there. I don't know. Anyway, let's go.
cultivated tastes. Wow! Ah, this is what it looks like before. Let me just give this one. Baby, let's go up. There's just stairs going up. Last nap, please. I just want to see. Oh. Maybe, maybe we will be killed here. Ooh. Ah, nothing, no man. Let's go. Mm -hmm. At least we went so. Mm -hmm. At least you saw that castle. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I hope. Because you are not too good. Yeah. Hi. Oh, you know that song? Yeah. Let's go there. Yeah, we didn't go there. Let's go there. So this was their cold storage. This is their cellar. These cellars provided effective cold storage but were prone to damp and vermin. Food could be kept in barrels, bottles, and jars, but sacks were only a short-term solution. In 1500s and 1600s, cellars were often equipped with simple wooden shelves on four legs. This would help keep food dry and help increase space. Picture. In a video, na lang. Another room to the right. The main purpose of this room was for storage, but the window alcoves are equipped with gun holes for muskets. Why is it wet? And the last room, I think, is this one. Oh, why is there a door here? I'm scared, baby. Maybe you want to go inside first? Well, this is just like the other storage rooms. There are five of these storage rooms here on the ground floor. Same, same, but this bigger. This is bigger, no? Let's go. There's one more. I think this is the exit already. Oh, wow. What is this, a church? Scary, baby. Why they didn't put light here? Lock, stock, and barrels. So that's the end of our Earl's Palace. Girls Palace tour, and now we are going. What's our next stop? Uh, food. Food. <laughs> Let's grab a food. Food truck. <laughs> <laughs> I think so, yeah. If we went inside, it's the same as that one. This private residence only. Oh, oh the people live there. Really? I am so sorry for the shaky footage. My camera is already down. It's dead. Where are we going? Grab a food. Let's go grab food. I think so because they're all in black. Somebody died. Yeah, somebody died.
Royal Bank of Scotland. Wow. That's cute. Yeah, I want to eat sandwich, baby. Mm -hmm. I want to eat sandwich. You want to eat sandwich? Mm -hmm. You? Yeah, I want to eat like real food, not ice cream. I think it's in the other side. I don't know. Let's ask the local people. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. Sorry. Um, can we ask where can we like eat like sandwiches or chicken maybe? Um, Restaurant. Bakers along that way, and there's also a shop down here. If you just keep going on the right, there's a shop called Brucey's and it has sandwiches as well. Just uh -huh. keep going down this side. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mom. Oh, baby. <laughs> Vikings. Oh, babe. <laughs> Blood, blood orange. Yeah. Wait, does that come with this one? Yeah. Ah, okay. What's yours? Yes, please. You don't like orange juice? Mm. Mm. So, is it the pesto 10 inch that you can keep? Pizza? Yeah. yeah. And the calamari is a star. No. And the polo? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much. That's it for our Kirk World Tour. I hope you enjoyed watching. Here are some clips. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And see you on the next one.